It takes about an hour and a half apparently to get up, up to this steep walking. And there's the tower that we were at, the bastion. We're a wee bit higher up now. And there's the clock tower. Or a snack bar at the very least. And there's the there's where we're aiming for. And here is us finally at Santa Barbara Church Grotto or whatever it is. And there's the United Nations of people here. Most of them are German. But we are from Belfast. So good for us. And that looks like a, a helipad over there. And that's the shelly that we were down at about five minutes ago. And this is the town of Riva. And we are in the land of Lilliput. And this is the, uh, the grotto to San Barbara. And we have climbed up to, uh, to see the sights here. And I will be signing the visitor's book. And this is what you see from Riva every night. <clears throat> and there's our Connor sitting there. Top of the world, Mama. Apparently the grotto here was built between uh, 1924 and 1929. And these are some of the guys that were responsible these were water engineers, they were, they were building a water pipeline uh, to produce hydroelectric uh, power down at uh, Riva here. And uh, this is, they, they decided to build a, a grotto here. So uh, these, these water engineers um, and hydroelectric men were the ones behind building the grotto here. Some undertaking. I must say, and the grotto is way up here somewhere. And the people down here sitting on the seat are German, and the next people are from uh, Utrecht, and then the people over here are from Denmark, and we are here from Belfast. And the unfortunate thing is that we have to make our way down again. Um, it's hard coming up, but it's probably even harder coming down. This is the actual notice board of what we did. Up from Riva, and then up to the up on the green line, up to uh, Bastion, and then on to Santa Barbara, the church or grotto. Right, we tramp uphill, steep.